Well, hello everyone. Who wants to crash land on an alien planet stuck in an infinite time loop and forced to die again and again because the only other life forms around are trying to kill you? Me! <laughs> So we are uh, playing through a little bit of a preview of Returnal today. Um, it is, we're only allowed to show 45 minutes of gameplay. Uh, um, I am a little bit worried. However, I think we'll be okay. I think, oh no, did I just accidentally skip the, uh... wait, 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 wait. I accidentally skipped that. What are you doing? This is Celine. Celine? Wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna do this right, we're gonna do this right. Uh, yes, Returnal. Uh, close game, thanks. Okay, here we go. Let's try that again. So, Returnal, preview. Only 45 minutes of gameplay. Uh, there, we're only allowed to show up to the, so there are, there are multiple biomes in this game. We're only allowed to show up to the second. I don't think we're going to get to the second because, uh, you know, full disclosure, I've played a little bit already because I'm working on some videos for the site that will go up later. Uh, well, for the channel that will go up later. Uh, and, hmm, it's quite difficult, this game. Um, it's fun. Very fun. Uh, but, oh, it's okay. So it's, it's not going to let me go backwards, but that's okay. Let's see how we go. So, uh, yeah, one of the rules was you have to start from a fresh... Uh, if we were going to stream it, we had to start from a fresh uh, save file. So that's all right. Uh, so there's going to probably not going to be any spoilers, honestly. Um, even though I've played a little bit already, I still don't know much more than uh, before I started playing the game. Um, but, it, oh, it looks so pretty, though. Um, also, uh, because this is a PS5 ex five exclusive, um, it, the dual sense is pretty amazing, I have to say. Um, when I'm kind of like standing in the rain here, uh, you can feel like the little uh, raindrops hitting uh, the gamepad, which is very, very cool. Um, and uh, you can feel the the haptic uh feedback on the triggers like if i'm pulling down this trigger now it kind of it kind of gets stuck halfway um but yeah it's very atmospheric isn't it so but we'll see how far let's see how far we can get with 45 minutes of gameplay because if there's any cutscenes, we're not counting those so let's see how far we can get this forest contains extensive ruins of a xenotype civilization yes Foundations and statues. And it's very dark and scary. Excellent. Perfect for a psychological horror. Alrighty. Hey, hop. Yeah, the jewel sense is really nice, especially when you're standing in the rain. Um oh hello, what are you? Scout log. <gasps> Identification on a helmet. It's <sighs> who didn't see that coming? <sighs> yeah, I have to say, even though um, this game is really tough, it is that that central mystery that keeps you coming back for sure, because um, it is. Uh, you know, there's there's sort of there's a lot of shooting, um, but it has got those roguelite elements where every time you die, you have to start again from the beginning. But there are some permanent items uh, that do carry over. So this is interesting as well. Um, yeah, you can kind of just we're going to get a sec an alt fire on our gun in a little while. Spoilers. Um, however. Uh, to do that, so that kind of recharges over a while, um, but you pull down the left trigger the full way to do that. I'll show you when we get the L fire, but you only have to pull the trigger down halfway um, to, wait a minute, what are we doing here? Oh, I see. Um, to fire, to do the regular fire, uh, which takes a little bit of getting used to for sure. 
suit computer. There's a lot of scanning as well. Discovered a potential resource. Positive analysis for suit repairs. Delicious. Classifying as Sophium. Let's eat it. Let's eat it and gain health. Alrighty. Whoop. That dash he does is very Moorish. Could do that all day. Oh, hello. Alrighty. Locked with a mechanism. Oh, look at this. How pretty. Hello, friends. Yeah, it is. It is a very nice looking game. All right, but we've got we've got a time limit. We got to keep going. Don't look at the tentacles too much. A bit more game audio. Thank you, Nightcat. Let's see how that goes. Tell me if that is if that audio is it. Is that too loud? Let's find out. Hi, friends. Whoop. Alrighty. Sure was. Didn't stand a chance, Celine. No, what have we got here? Captain's log. Recorded log found. Adding to data bank. Playing back now. You can get a little bit lost in uh, in the mini map in this game, but it is very handy to keep checking it. Elapsed time: thirty minutes since last crash. Whole areas of this forest are rearranging themselves like a fluid puzzle after each of my deaths. When Whenever I return, per Astro Protocol, I will not be recovered until I reach the broadcast signal. If you're hearing this, you are stuck here too. I think we're talking to ourselves. So, yeah, so that's kind of the idea. I don't remember recording that. She's stuck in an infinite time loop, and until she, she gets all the way to the end, she's stuck here. And I guess the mystery is, why, why, why? Um... But yeah, it's, um, it is a very, very intriguing, very atmospheric game. Yeah, we know the dash. Whoa. Oops. Hold to scan. More Sylphium. So yeah, if your health is full and you pick up little, little bits of Sylphium, you see the little uh, notches by our health bar. If you get three of those lit up, then it'll extend your health by a bit. But again, these things are only good for this run. And then if you die, everything resets again. So, thank you. Uh, where are we going? Um, and there are lots of little things around about that, you know, we'll only be able to utilize um, on later runs as well. Because uh, there are things that I'm encountering even a little bit further when I've got a few more tools that I still can't bypass, so. Alrighty. Get the lizard dogs! Whoop. Ah, no. That glow there. Um, so, the longer you kind of keep going and and sort of don't take damage you're increasing your adrenaline and from what i understand um that you get little little perks the longer the longer you can kind of keep that going a malignant key malignant items have a chance of causing malfunctions they have negative effects or can even inhibit certain actions so you kind of have to you kind of have to weigh up whether you want to do that or not um, so, like, some malignant actions I've had before are th your weapon does 30% less damage, or, um, you, uh, you know, just, just little things like that, like your suit has less integrity for a while. You can negate those malignant actions by, by picking up artifacts, I think, but it's a risk if you want to do it, really. But I like that, you know, that's one of the classic things about roguelites, right? You know, that sort of risk-reward thing. This seems fine. All right, lads. I've discovered piled corpses of a xenotype species 
Likely the architects of these ruins. These could be the sentience that broadcast the white shadow signal. So we're after that signal. We're making our way. And every time you die, these rooms, they're not they're not the same every time. Um they will rearrange. I think I don't know I don't think it is procedurally generated per se. I think the rooms to escape. The rooms are the same, it's just the layout that's different. I'm always brought back by There is a moment between death and rebirth when tentacles drag me down, screaming, drowning. That sounds nice. Returning. It's probably fine, eh? Encounter hostile predator. <gasps> no, I don't think I'm supposed to uh, survive this. If anyone does, fair play to them because uh Yeah, it hits hard. It hits real hard. You know, and I I do you do encounter those things later. They're not that bad. So I think I think we're supposed to die there. So we're not counting that. <laughs> Is that some heterochromia I see, Celine? Heterochromia is so cool. Uh... Alright, now it gets real. Uh, oh, we have a super chat. Uh, Phil Mc3 just passed the Viva for my PhD! Amazing! Congrats! That's such good news! Oh. Astra, this is Celine. I survived it. I survived my death. Can you hear me? I'm in my ship. Suit status operational and fully operational. Okay. This is, I think, just a log of everything that we've done so far. Yeah. So we've had one death, eleven areas explored, seven eliminated. Alright, well let's see if we can do better than that this time. And let's head on out. So you're in first person in your ship, and then once you get outside, there we go. Whoa. The cycle. Every time you die, you returned with the weapons, artifacts, and resources without the weapons. Okay. And then, yeah, so permanent items will kind of help your progression, but everything else is reset. So let's see how the layout is different this time. The environment Ooh. wasn't like this before. And as you can see, um, the map very handily pinpoints. As soon as you enter a room, you can see where the health items are um, and where, uh, like, the uh, kind of currency of the game is, any little items. Um, sometimes it's, they're not that easy to reach, but you can at least think about how you might get there, right? So let's see if we can get... Now, I jumped into this before and I immediately died so I don't know that I can get those yet and I'm not feeling too brave to be honest with you um should we go and get that that's some obelite over there so let's go there's no fall damage so what's this yes a mysterious resource that is kept on death <gasps> I didn't see that when you fall down, uh, there are a lot of kind of, there's a lot of difficult terrain in this game. Um, if you have health, I, it's not an instant death. You, you just you just take a little bit of a, a penalty, um, but it's not gonna knock you all the way back, which I think is fair. Can you imagine? Whew. Alrighty, what are you? What are you? Ah, here we go. Lovely. Augments my weapon with an alternative firing mechanism. So, so this is me pulling the trigger down halfway. This is now pulling it down f the full way. It's pretty powerful. This will be useful. But it does take a while to recharge, so you can't you can't uh, can't rely on it so much, and you have to sort of 
really think about when it is that you want to deploy that. Oh, and also your dash makes you um, uh, invincible for a few frames, so you can dash through projectiles and things like that. Uh, being mindful of where you might end up, of course. Like that. You think I timed that, didn't you? No, then. Whee! It's okay, we'll get some more health and we'll patch ourselves up right nice. Um, this is a. Whee! Ooh. I don't think we can get this yet. Yeah. Okay, we can't pick that up just yet. That's all right. Where's the health? Where's the health? We're supposedly standing right beside it, right underneath it. I need to look where I'm going. Oh, it's in there. Okay, we can't get that yet either. But we can move through this door. No. What are, what are you? <gasps> Beep boop. Are those the PlayStation symbols on our little interface there? Acquired a xenotype weapon, similar to our carbine technology. Nice. What do you all think of the game so far anyway? Do you like the look of it? Um, we haven't figured that out yet. All right, that's fine. So new weapon. Let's see how we let's see how we do with that. Beyond which is the white shadow signal. Oh, that is a massive wall. I can't cross the chasm. For now, I'll change objectives and investigate the energy reading in the forest. Alrighty. To the forest. This is so cool. Pretty atmospheric. Uh, oh. Okay, we're gonna hide here because there's quite a lot of those balls flying at my face. Whoops. Ah, oh. oh, you prick. <laughs> These are all cheats. Send them down that wee narrow corridor. Oh. Alright, that's almost there, almost there. Whew. My goodness me. All right, let's see if we can grab some health. Now this here, I'll be honest with you, I don't really want to do it because, um, so what that, what that does, if you want to know, um, is Celine will track the movements of another scout, um, to see their last where they died and I think that I think that plays into the multiplayer functionality as in I think you're seeing other players as Celine um, in their last moments however if you track that um, it uh, it triggers uh, something to attack and I I don't want to die yet I want to see how far we can make it through this this quick little playthrough so if you don't mind I'll save that for the next time we play um, just because I think it'll be fun to um, to get a bit further in, right? Ooh, what are you? Let's try this. This is there's so many nice little touches with the jewel sense. Like there's kind of like a very and it's um it's very uh, very subtle. Like it's not it's never too much. Like there's it, it's so subtle that sometimes you don't even think about it. Like when I'm picking up all the little obelite stuff, it's just a very slight rumble. Um, but it really adds to, adds to the immersion. Oh shit. I think something's still attacking me. Yeah, it is, is it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Maybe I should kill that first. I was doing an Ian Hickton and trying to loot before uh, clearing the area. Xenotype device acquired. I think this will prove a useful tool. 
Yes, I think so too. So you can pick up random little consumables as you go, and it's good to just use them because you can't take them with you when you die. So there'll be lots of different little uses for them. Some will be like alternate attacks, some will be uh, health, um, some will grant you like uh, weapon proficiency straight off the bat. Um, so yeah, it's good to good to pick them up. And, uh, and right now you can only carry one, so if we find any more, we'd have to um, we'd have to drop what we have. All right, so we can't get in there yet. Adrenaline level four. So again, if I get hit, uh, I think my adrenaline level whoa, will reset to zero. Those things scare the crap out of me, watch. Oh! However, they are kind of helpful because I'm not taking damage when it's, I don't think I'm taking damage when it's grabbing at me like that, but because they like suck you up, you can use it to get to some higher platforms that you wouldn't otherwise be able to get to. So. Let's see. Is there any health that I can actually have right now? Yes. Thanks. Lovely. Not quite at full health, which is um, disappointing, but... Doo -doo -doo. Oof. This seems fine. What are you? Hello. I would not be sticking that on myself, but you do you, Celine, I guess. There's absolutely no chance, no chance. Safe to repurpose. Appears and is are two very different things. System integration complete. Performing a function test to confirm. Alrighty. So, so th th this is the, the kind of um, permanent uh, tool that will now it'll we'll keep it if we if we when we die we'll still have that when we respawn so where do you see this though Boop. how about damn particles Could, <laughs> confirmed Blah. point to point teleportation it's handy location exit seems fixed so there, we did pass one, uh, by one of those teleporters to get here, so now I guess we just go find it. However, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, we're going this way, I guess. Wait, this way? Yeah, it's a little bit dark, especially when there's studio lights on me. Uh, but we'll, we'll, we'll get there. Here we go. There we are. Lovely. Boom. So. <gasps> Whoa, hello. Hello, hello. Hi, wasn't expecting you. Whoo. Hey, look at that. We did it. We survived the, the thing. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that was a bit scary. Yes, I'll have you, and I'll have you as well. Now, do bear in mind, I've been playing this for a little while. Uh, if I'm making this look, a l like, easy, it's, it's not. <laughs> it's definitely not. I definitely died quite a few times the first time around to get to, to this point, for sure. Whee! And there's the gate. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go. Discovered xenotype technology that produces other devices. That seems fine. This is, seems very friendly. Um, so, we can get some health. We can get a uh, huge amount of weapon proficiency. Uh, so that's your, I believe that's your weapon proficiency there underneath your uh, health. Your adrenaline is the little, the little level that comes up in the middle of the screen when we're fighting. Uh, oh, oh, we can't, we cannot, uh, that seems really good though, but we can't afford it. Uh, repairs integrity at 5% of damage dealt. So 
We can only really get, uh... Do I want this? I think I want this. Yeah, let's do it. Excellent. All right. So, we've got ourselves some weapon proficiency. This, I think, you can, um... Yeah, you can exchange... You can, you can exchange ether for obelites and vice versa. Look at that volumetric lighting! She does love to scan, as we Celine. Evidence of rudimentary xenotype language discovered. Mm-hmm. Currently lacking resources to decipher the xenoglyph. So now that we have this, uh, now that we have the, um, the thing that she stuck on her back very willingly, uh, this will make it a lot handier to get around, uh, in future runs, but now we can teleport between all those little things that we've uh, encountered before. But we won't want to do that just yet. Um, no. There's another wee scan thing, another wee cipher. Discovered a fragment of the xenotype language. Uh, and we'll find those as we go along. Detecting a strange energy reading. Okay. Alrighty, let's get going. So we can't get through that barrier just yet. We're gonna need to find some more tech. Oh, feck it. No thanks, no thanks. Sir, can you not? Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh, my adrenaline was reset. I didn't want my adrenaline reset. It must never be reset. <gasps> you fecker. You fecker, get away. Oh, that was dramatic. Something just fell down. Uh, because of the wind. Ha ha! <gasps> Who? Oh, that's, a, <laughs> that's my weapon. It has ricochet, I see. Scared by my own bullets. Um, okay. So. <gasps> she was too eager. I'm my own worst enemy. Uh, but, so. Oh, I just gave away that wee bit of health. That's irritating. I must always be at full health. So that's fine. We're headed over here then. Very well. Oh, we have a new member. Uh, Aaron Cole. Boom. Welcome. Thanks for joining us, Aaron. Um, so there are, uh, there are lots of members only videos that you can watch now. <gasps> and, um, and I hope that you will enjoy all the new emojis as well. So, we've got a carbine. Uh, do we want to swap it for a blaster? I actually don't. I don't really want the shotgun. I quite like the, um, I quite like the, oh, by the way, so these, yeah, these gates that I'm ignoring, uh, those are little side paths where you can get little extra bits and pieces, probably some extra health, maybe some extra weapons, uh, and that kind of currency. Uh, I'm ignoring those at the minute because I just want to get a little bit further, but, um, yeah, uh, that'll be something that we can explore later. Uh, so that's another kind of, it's kind of a shortcut, I guess. Those shortcuts opened, or shortcuts to backtrack at least. Because there are, there is some... You prick! Come on then! <gasps> oh, he's mad! <gasps> oh, he for you're an idiot! You nearly did that again! Alright, we're gonna use these pillars to our advantage here. You see what I mean, though? He's a bit easier than last time! A bit. Yeah, a bit easier than last time. You pricks, go away. Nobody even wants to talk to you. You're not even... You're not even an antagonist in this story. Oh. Who? Where? Hello! There we go. Now, is this a gun we want? Yes! Yeah, it's a little bit better. A little bit of an upgrade. We'll take it. <gasps> now, there's lots of health around here. If we could only have some peace to track it down. Lovely. 
<gasps> oh no, get away, get away. Just makes me panic. Oh, I'm sorry, thank you, I can't. I did not realize that I was covering up the HP bar. Sorry, everyone. It's been full this entire time. Uh, so what do we do? Alt fire? Oh, I haven't... Honestly, I don't really use these. I probably should. Let's keep this one. What's this? However, yeah. Yeah, let's... There's two. We have two of those, so let's use those. Um, oh, there's another enemy in here. I can see them on the minimap. Hiya. Hello. There's a good tentacle dog lizard thing. There we go. That's more like it. No, there is some health, but I believe it's probably behind a bar area. Yes, it is. Um, that one's up there. Let's just keep. Let's keep going. Let's keep going this way. Alrighty. We haven't got too much. Too much longer left. I'm gonna say we've been. Is it? A, do you reckon it's about a half an hour of gameplay? Uh, I'm gonna say maybe. Whoa. So I'm gonna try and keep going. I basically just want you to see the first boss of the. Oh, I want you to see the first boss of uh, of the world at least. That can't be here. And yet, and yet. locked i actually so i've so i've encountered the house many times so far have yet to open it i don't know what i don't know what it takes to unlock the door haven't haven't found out yet so maybe we'll figure that out together who knows now then oh god no sir Oh, you prick. <gasps> prick. Prick, 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 prick. I was trying to do my grind surgy thing. There we go, there we go, there we go. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Whew, took a wee bit more damage there than I wanted to. <gasps> Fuck! Oh. <laughs> you cheeky, cheeky so-and-so. No, I don't even want that. Don't even want it. Where? Who? Why? I'm very on edge. Back off! Back off! I look like I know what I'm doing now, but if you if you had seen me trying to remember that I only have to pull the left hand trigger down halfway before. Takes a little bit of getting used to, not gonna lie. But now it feels quite natural, so. Okie dokie. There's another one, I can hear you. The 3D sound is also very handy for, um, for figuring out, because it is quite dark, as you can see. Um, oh, you fucker. But the 3D audio is um, not only quite scary, but handy for figuring out where threats are coming from when you don't want to like have your eyes locked on the, um, on the minimap all the time. Intriguing. Um, can we reach any more of the health, do you reckon? I don't think we can, so I'm just going to power on. Uh, no, should isn't left trigger, Brendan Hart. It's just that, um, so let me try and show you. So when, you, when you're when you aiming, you only have to pull, push left trigger down halfway uh, to aim, but it, full way to get alt fire going. Um, and there is, like, there's that, oh, jeez. 
that was a terrible place to stop and do that, but, uh... uh run away! Yikes! Yikes! What the... what the... what? Um... I think I've come the wrong way. Yes, I have. <laughs> Let's do it. I cannot fight these things, nor can I progress uh, where I currently am, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna flee! Flee like the brave space scout that I am. Please don't hurt me. <sighs> ah! Okay, that was fine. Alright. Okay, we, we were just going on a little adventure. A little side quest. Um, here's, the, here's the gate that we actually wanted. There we go. Oh. Here we go, here we go. <gasps> what and why are you? Oh, good. Huh. Huh. You don't seem very friendly, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ignore you. Fecker, 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 fecker. Let's just let's just do we do we circuit do we loop. Whew. <laughs> ah, mushroom man, get away from me! Ah. Do not like, do not like. So close. I was so close. Girl. <sighs> Nuts. Crash. Again. Purseline. Again and again and again and again. All right. Well, that's okay. Can't hear me. Cause it's a little bit. It's a little bit different every time. And we're still we're still unlocking uh, some of the tools that we need, so this is good. Discovered. Discovered. A strange device that is already active. It feels alive. And looks gross. Stop blinking. Not receiving any information from scanning. Stick your arm in, sure gone. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, she's doing it and all. Oh no, it just, it just farted on you. Oh, it farted out a, a vial of very fancy perfume, maybe. What are you? Chthonos. Successful overloads generate energy bolts that, oh yeah, let's have that. Yeah, that sounds great. Thanks. A freebie. Now let's see how we get on. Could the force be adapting? Probably. Uh, so, where's our friends? There's one. Okie dokie. <gasps> oh! Rude. Absolutely not. Thanks. Is that all of them? Sometimes it's kind of hard to tell. <laughs> You see? No thanks, giant alien turret. Uh, right, what time are we at? Hmm, we don't have much longer. Um, let's see, I really wanted to get to the final boss and I was so close, but that's fine, that's fine. Um, I'm dithering, now I'm dithering. Uh, right, let's just go straight to the gate. Let's see what, let's see what happens. Ah. No, I'm at the wrong gate. Okay, fine. Let's go over here. This way! Ah. 
see what happens when you just wanna you just wanna get things done. I don't have a key. That's all right. Let's go up here and ar go around. This way. Maybe we'll see the house again. Or we'll die horribly. There we go. Nice. Away. Away from here. Thanks. <gasps> hmm. Okay. Oh gosh, you're still here. Well, I tell you what, we're not gonna we're not gonna make it through another run, I don't think. How about I scan this unknown suit signal and show you what happens then? Let's just let's end on a bit of a challenge. I've encountered our black box technology holograms. They're showing my last moments. Scavenge three ether. Oh, so you can okay, so if you have enough enough ether, you can scavenge rather than avenge. It's a bench. Let's let's see. Let's see what happens. I'm very scared. I don't really fully understand. Ah, you fucking oh, jeez. What am I? Why am I stuck? Oh, you. Yeah, I'm panicking now. What the? F Any health around here at all? At all? At all? I don't know why that's there. I've not seen those purple barriers before. I just assume that's part of the this new and extended challenge. Again, though, you don't have to do this, so I would I would recommend when you're still finding your way early in the game to not, <laughs> um, especially if you're kind of prioritizing just um, sort of enjoying the story or just at least figuring out you know learning the ropes. Let's see. And use cover to your advantage, because if the game didn't want to let, wouldn't, uh, didn't want to let you do that, then it wouldn't. All right. Ooh. Oh, thank God. Yes, I'll have that, please. Thanks. What are you? Eh, slightly better, I guess. And then there's our ticket out of here. Do do do. What gun have we got this time? Anyway, I would love to hear uh, everyone's thoughts, um, what they think of the game, whether they uh, like us to keep playing it here. I don't know if my nerves can hack it, but maybe I'll get better at it, uh, you know, before we stream again. Who knows? Um, I will be working on a review video um, that, um, that will be going up a little bit later on, so keep an eye out for that. Um, and yeah, uh, I do really like I do really like it so far. I wasn't sure at first. I was like, "Am I having a good time? Am I enjoying this?" But I, I am. It's just it. It's um, I think once it gets its hooks in you, as is the way with uh, games of this of this type, it's very difficult to put down. Um, so yeah, I will. I'll have to finish up now, because that's probably around 45 minutes of gameplay. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this early look. And oh god, you're still alive! <laughs> and um, yeah, there's there's quite a few... Uh, like, this is all this is all quite um, like dark and spooky, this part of the game. But um, I've seen uh, little, little sneaky glimpses of, of bits later on, and... Yeah, it does, it does change up, and I am intrigued to find out the rest of the story, so... Um, thank you all so much for joining me. Um, I'm sorry I died so many times, 
and thank you to everyone who joined and super chatted thank you as always to our regulars and our mods of course and i will see you all very very soon bye